Hi, welcome to Grandpa's World. I'm Alora. I'm Ashlyn. I'm Renee. And today we're reading this that we still believe, for whatever reason. And the first one is the five second rule. And for what, whatever reason, we still believe that after five seconds, if something hits the floor, we can still eat it. It's kind of gross, but because in five seconds, a lot of germs can get on it, and that's kind of gross. And okay, next one. Some people actually <laughs> yell five second rule if they see you drop food. I'm not one of those people, but I've heard some people yell that. Yeah. From across the room. I mean, like if you're at someone else's house and you drop your food and. Five second rule and what? <laughs> Especially if they have animals, you don't want to eat off someone else's floor because you don't know when the Ew. last time their animal has peed or pooped on that spot of floor. Just don't eat floor food. Like me. <laughs> <laughs> I think everyone still does though. Okay. I don't. Whatever. Okay, the next one is you can't go swimming until you've waited an hour after eating. Supposedly we will get the cramps because it but it's not true. Yes, get the cramps. The the cramps. <laughs> the cramps. <laughs> okay. Cracking your knuckles will give you arthritis. Nope. What? It doesn't. But later on it can compromise your grip strength and cause oh. swelling. Probably I've been, shouldn't. I've been cracking my knuckles my entire life. I'll do this the rest of the video so I'm not tempted to. <laughs> okay. Twinkies okay. last forever. They don't. No, they have shelf life twenty five days. Yeah. What? I thought they lasted forever because I watched this show and it was like. Oh my god. Thirty twenty five. The year thirty twenty five. And like there was a Twinkie from like nineteen ninety eight. Ew. <laughs> and like they ate it. Ew. It's called Mortal Engines or whatever. Ew. They would have got some seriously <laughs> nasty. Yeah. Like all the houses were machines. The last. Stuff myth that people believe is vaccines cause autism. Everybody's been talking about this lately, it does not. Yeah, there have been many studies well, proving that shots actually. do not cause autism. Some people, like, it just depends what you're allergic to. Oh, like, if something if something is in the vaccine that you're allergic to, I mean, it might make well, you Well, if, if you're allergic to it, I don't I wouldn't think that they'd give it to you, but... But okay. if you don't know you're, like, allergic to it, then it gives you autism, and then you're just no. kind of whale? <laughs> what? Okay. I know all those anti-vax people be like crystals and essential oils. Magic. <laughs> yes, magic. No. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you going magic? Magic. This is simple for magic, <laughs> oh apparently. I don't know. <laughs> okay, whatever. It's the end of the video. So, thank you for watching. I don't, I don't know. Like, subscribe, and... I just messed up that word. Like, <laughs> subscribe, and hit the bell if you like us. Yay! Goodbye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>